Anyways, this is the analysis game for Billy. So we're going to ignore chat. That's what an analysis game is. And I'm going to try to explain everything that I'm doing to my, the best of my ability. I will be right back, chat. Okay. All right. This is a bad map for Billy, but we'll see how we do. This is just a bad map because it's very hard to use chainsaw for mobility in this map. The loops are kind of wonky. Whispers is off. Whispers turned on. That means they're within this 32 meter range. Probably on the outside. Are they? No. I guess they're on the left. That box is open. Hey there. We knew we saw that that box was open, so we knew that they were nearby. Wasted. That's actually probably gonna waste a lot of pallets. I'm gonna go on this side because we think we're under, she's gonna run through, and she did. She has the god pallet. She's, oh, I thought she was camping it. She's not. That was actually a good job. Is she looking behind herself? She is not. She's not tilting her head. But she runs through everything. Huh. Real survivor. Damn. I should have hesitated. Backpedal. Backpedal again. God damn it, dude. I did not think she was just gonna run straight into my face. And so, I don't know how to explain that. <laughs> I feel like that was pretty basic in my mind, but, um, of course, like, somebody, I don't know. So, like, right here, I, uh, I saw that her, I saw her head, and I saw that she was turning, and so I knew 100% that she was going to turn into the loop. Oh, I could have hit him. And so I just fully committed to the chainsaw. Playing very bad because I'm playing bad. So what I did there is I shut my red light on the other side so he panic bolt. I did that a couple times to where he got in a rhythm. People get in muscle memory rhythms to where they keep on vaulting the pallet over and over, even if they know that they shouldn't. And so if you can get somebody to vault a pallet like two or three times, then they're just gonna keep on doing it. Somebody across the map. We got somebody right here as well. Hello, thing. She has that vault there. She didn't use the vault. Tried it for chainsaw. Oh my god. Good job. Ooh, she should have thrown that. She killed herself. I wasn't charged enough. She should be dead, but I messed up. I should have been 99 charged there. I didn't realize. And so right there with the thing, I assumed that she wasn't going to move much, and she didn't. She uh, flicked her head to the right, and so I thought that she was going to flick right, and she did. It's really just head movement. Like, that's what I go off of. I don't even really think about it, but I'm trying to, like, think about how I chainsaw people. Because it's just something that I've done for a while. But yeah, you can tell, like, when whenever somebody, like, looks left and right, that usually indicates where they're going to try to dodge to. Ready our chainsaw, she's gonna throw this down. Um hmm. We're gonna like this, so she goes to 50 50. She did not go for it. Ooh. Alright, we're gonna M1 here. Just because that person is doing the gen. We don't wanna waste time, especially on this map. String him up. We don't see them on barbecue. Okay, this dude uses unbreakable. We're just gonna pick him up. We're gonna try to hook rush him. By hook rush, I mean we're just gonna try to out hook him before they can do the generators. We don't have very many hooks though. 
Got a thing right there. That means the other person's going this way, most likely. Am I right? No? Possibly? Maybe? No. Even if it can't be, are they saved? I guess he went around. Huh. He's gonna drop it. Reason why I knew he was gonna drop it is because he ran directly into me, so he panicked and he saw me charging my chainsaw, and so he immediately wanted that pallet down. A good survivor wouldn't freak out and they might uh, try to like see where I'm going. But that's usually most people's reaction. As soon as they run into the killer, they want to immediately drop the pallet. We're gonna M1 because they're all right here. I don't want to waste time chainsawing. Even though I could for style points. Hi. I didn't even know she was right there. I just saw... I, I saw that the scratch marks were fading, but I still saw the uh, the blood pools. That's so how I knew that she was around the loop. Oh. Ah! Nice. I just pick up. We've won this game. Oh, maybe not. Because we tumbled. Now we may lose this game. I wanted to be nice. Did we tunnel again? No, we didn't. Maybe I shouldn't have been nice. We got six hooks though. That's not, that's not bad at all. Uh, we're try gonna try to go around here. We hear them. Ready our chainsaw. Damn it. That should have been 99 there. But I actually didn't think she was gonna go for the window. I didn't think she would see it. We're gonna default back to the hook. I assume that there will be an easier chase here. Go left and went right. We're gonna go left. Damn, they went far. It's the guy we tunneled. Quote unquote. So we're most definitely gonna go after him. Because he doesn't have decisive. We could chainsaw here, but I have a feeling that he would do that. Yeah. I think about chainsawing, but I assume that he was gonna play the loop. And I didn't want to give him, like, while I'm in cooldown, I didn't want to give him distance. We can chase off through here. Saw somebody right here. We're going to try to see if we can see them. If not, try to chase off across the map. This gen. This first block on. Under right here. Hello. Got another person right there. That was an injured thing. He's looking right. Damn it. They still need to get one more gen done. If they have a key. Just keep on looking right. Damn it. I was hoping that she would dodge, but she done it. All right, so she really wants to go right. She's finally gonna look. If I would have more committed to the, I, I kept on thinking she was gonna dodge left, but she didn't. But like, as you can see, like she kept on looking right and she kept on churning right. Gimme, gimme, chicken tendies. Pretty good tell, at least from what I've seen. So we're gonna chainsaw over here. We can't get very far. Still, gain a little bit of distance. We're gonna pop this so we don't see them. Do we see any blood on the floor? We do not. Whispers is still on. Hmm. I think that they're still over here. I mean, we know that they're still over here because Whispers is on. We do not know where, though. Hmm. Oh, well. Not that big of a deal. Ooh, but we got scratch marks right here, though. They went out. Yeah, they did go out. Huh. I saw her right here. Hello. Is that a dead I was not patient at all there. She kept on spinning in a circle. What you do to counter that is you just backpedal. 
You backpedal and just hold your saw. But I thought I could get her, but I wasn't patient. Pull out her saw again. Damn. Keep on not being patient. Backpedal. Yep. We're just gonna hold our saw for years. There we go. And that's really the main part of playing Billy. It's just being patient. Because every time I miss a chainsaw, it's because I'm not patient. I just want to get the down as quickly as possible, and usually that wastes time. Alright, I do not know where they are at all. I'm just gonna walk around, see if we can run into them. Oh, they're right there. Okay, thanks. I don't I don't know why you do that, but sure. That was a very bad idea from the Dwight. Maybe he can get lucky with the hatch, I don't know. But you're a chainsaw, I'm not gonna use it because he's gonna go around this. GG. He's hoping we would run into the middle, but we just uh, played around it. I think we back. I, I honestly don't even know. <laughs> I do things in the game, and like I don't even know. Like, especially with Billy. Like, I can see myself doing him. I'm not sure why I'm doing him. I gotta like try to think back to what I'm doing. But he, he was just hoping that we'd run into it. I don't think this was a very helpful Billy game, but. Because it wasn't a very normal map. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Hello. So sagely, thank you for the follow. Thank you, Julia, for the request. Now oh, we need to spend points. 